Welcome everyone, GamerCop here. This is episode 28 of Satisfactory. So, um, up there in the upper right hand corner, the industrial manufacturing, I think that should unlock us to get uh, the ability to make computers. And if we can make computers, then we should be able to unlock the ability to make um, oil gas or gas power plants. Yeah, yeah. So, I have all these guys made up now. There we go. 11 minutes, and then now... If we go to oh whatever so now if we go to not that one that one we're we're darn close so i mean we could probably get that wrapped up real quick but this is the one i want i believe yeah fuel generator so this is the one we're going to select here um but yes that's what we're trying to accomplish is get those computers but we should be able to manufacture um computers now which i don't know if they're going to be under here or in a different there they are computers um, so, okay, that's a lot of stuff. So <laughs> we need circuit boards as well, but, uh, let's go ahead. So to make a hundred computers, we think we have some, how many do we have in our inventory right now? We have 21. So we need to make 79 more. So if I go in there, parts, 79 more. I'm just going to get, I'm just going to put 79 in our to do list that way. I can make sure I have everything I need to make them, which it looks like it's, uh, oh, uh, remove one. <laughs> okay, so those guys, we need how many of those? 790 of those. Yeah, we're not going to do that one, but uh, that way we'll just, we'll leave one on there so we can see what it needs. Now we'll just, we'll take it off. I just got to write that down. I'm not going to put 790 in there. Uh, so two copper sheets and then four, is that rubber? Plastic, four plastic, four plastic. Okay. Uh, remove okay, and I think I need to put a conveyor belt from our oil refinery up to here at some point If you remember we have our little oil refinery zone um, So yeah, we need to get let's start working on some of this. So we have Should have some copper sheets coming into here. Yeah, we're manufacturing those which is great We need a boatload of those it looks like um, based on this um, Okay, and let's get uh, one of these maybe even two of these factories out here working on these circuit boards These are our little personal combiners we can take all that out of there recipe we're gonna do um ooh, did not in there electron oh there we go at the bottom aha i was about to say it should be in there and that ooh, there we go and it should be making those fairly quickly okay fantastic and then we could probably set a second one we don't need any more statters right now select recipe we'll do what does fabric takes? We do need some of that. Oh, that does. That's interesting. Take some biomass and stuff. We'll worry about that later, though. I'm not too bothered by that right now. Um, obviously, we need more plastic. So that's what it kind of comes down to. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to end up having to. I mean, I got to go pick up some more stuff, obviously. So I'm probably going to head out there. Um, I might work on getting. Do we have. Is this working on manufacturing? Yes, just those right now. Oh, that's right. The upper. I think I shut off the upper production. Let's go ahead and dump out our inventory here to leave it all behind because we don't really need any of this uh, right now. So um, store all. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff. Yeah, we don't want to do that. Yeah, we can store the rest in there. So we don't really need, we'll take some cement in case we need it. Um, in case we need any beacons for any reason, which I don't think we'll need that many, if any. Um, I'll bring the, well, we have a taser actually right now, I believe. Uh, oh, we don't actually have a taser. We'll be all right. We have, uh, we do need ammunition though definitely should bring ammunition that's for sure that would be a poor decision uh let's put all that in there we probably should make some more ammo so i'll make another uh another 100 rounds probably 100 rounds would be fine um in case i do decide to do the conveyor belt back we need that um you know what <sighs> yeah we should build one shouldn't we i'm not gonna build it yet though i think we'll hold off so i'm gonna make those bullets and i'm gonna go out there and pick up some stuff for us um, and kind of work on that so that's my plan so um i'll start working on getting that going here yeah this won't take too long to get these guys manufactured up and then i'll bring you guys back in uh hopefully when we have all the stuff needed to get the expanded power infrastructure up there in the upper right hand corner so that's the plan uh so yeah i'll see you guys later on all right guys i just wanted to give you guys a quick update <laughs> i've been oh gosh i've been at it for a while now <laughs> if you look up the upper right hand corner i'm making progress um slow but surely so we're we're gonna get there but yeah it's just taking a while um we'll go dump what we have here in a second in gosh so much plastic i think i calculated the total amount of plastic we're gonna need for it is like almost five thousand. 
units of plastic. <laughs> And that's not even the worst. I mean, screws right now are down pretty far down on there, but they were up to like six or 7,000 screws. And yeah, it's a lot of stuff when you start compiling the fact that you're making stuff more and more complicated as you go. Um, okay, and actually the volume is really down on the game, so I apologize. You may not be able to hear it as well. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and put those in. Put those in. So, oh, we're 20 computers away and eight modular frames. <laughs> oh, we are so close, ladies and gentlemen. We are so close. Um, uh, actually, yeah, we're just, uh, power's our main issue right now. We don't have enough to run our four manufacturing plants out back and to run the upper part of the factory. So I've been waiting for the batteries to kind of charge up a little bit, and then I can run part of the one half of the factory and it just, uh, cluster. But anyhow, we still need quite a bit more, uh, to make 20 computers, we need 200 more circular or circuit, ah, geez, circuit boards. It looks like yeah, modular frames, heavy modular frames. Yeah. Jeez Louise, yeah. Um, we don't need all this stuff on here. Uh, but yeah, we're we're making slow but sure progress. <laughs> oh gosh, there's some more. We'll put that one in there. Put some more of those guys in there. And then how's this guy doing? On beams, we're actually probably pretty good. What, when you eight more? Yeah, we're good on beams. So I'm not going to worry about uh, feeding the beams anymore. We'll just, uh, yeah, we'll leave them alone. Well, we're, I mean, we'll need them later. That's fine. So just load it up so it can keep working for a while. Um, we need more copper sheeting for that, so, so we can build three more of these. Let's build them real quick. One, there's two, and there's three. So making progress, we need more of, oh gosh, we can't make, oh, we need more of these. That's right. Oh, see, this is where it gets just super complicated. Well, not really complicated, I guess, but there's just, there's a lot of pieces of the puzzle here. So modular frame wise to make, we need five more heavy modular frames, so we need 25 more modular frames. So we need to get that number down there so where we have enough of these to make 25 of those. And then once we can make 25 of those, then we can make 25 modular frames. Well, it's gonna get up to 26, I guess, because it's in units of two. But once we get up there, then we can make those, then we should be able to make the, we should everything we need to make the modular frames at that point. Then the only thing we need more of is more copper sheeting and probably more plastic in order to finish up our computer production for the last 20 computers. And we already had 21 computers to start, so we even had a bit of a head start on it, which was uh, very nice, but oh gosh, so much of uh, so much production to be done. We're close here though on this. And actually, is there any in here? Yeah, there's two right there, perfect. So that'll be it for that. So um, let's make more of these guys might as well oh gosh yeah they take so much work to make them too that's part of the issue just so much we've gone through so many materials building these stupid components for this oh gosh sorry guys i thought we'd make it a little bit farther oh too and i can talk about the conveyor belt so i tried to build a conveyor belt actually out to our oil production because i was tired of driving out there and only having like a thousand plastic there and it just is slow production i mean it's actually producing them fairly quickly but it's just still slow when you need so much plastic so I went out there and I tried to build it and I thought I got about halfway with my first conveyor belt and it took about, uh, was it seven or 800 iron or steel beams to build it out that far? And then I ended up, uh, and then I checked again and uh, let's build this last one here, even though we have, we have enough to build all of those. Oh, we're short still, we're still gonna be short, huh? We'll see what we get here. But anyhow, then I came back and got like another six or 700 and I tried to finish it and I still didn't have enough. I probably need like another 300 iron or steel beams in order to finish it. Okay, we have, oh yeah, I do have eight of those. Okay, so that's done. Wow, we had an extra modular frames that I didn't realize we had. So we have eight of those, those are done, which is fantastic. So the modular frames over here, um, we don't need to worry about. It's only the computers we're trying to build now. So I actually, I'll probably clean that up here in a second. Let's actually just do that. Um, parts, there's the modular frames. There's so many on there. We'll just get rid of all of them. I think you can clear that list if you go into the build. You can if you go into the build, but we don't really care that much. Okay, there. So that's just, that's literally all we need. We've cleaned it up quite a bit. Let's go get these guys put away real quick. And then uh, while you guys are in here, I think we'll just uh, go. My power's still on? Yep, okay. It's still chugging away. Actually, let me go ahead and just turn up the volume for you guys. There. Okay. 
Um, boom! Look at that. We just need 20 computers. And then that'll get us to where we can have the fuel. And if we, honestly, if this factory works full time, like it actually does what it's supposed to do, what it's designed to do, because we just, our power infrastructure really was what's slowing us down. That'll be a big deal for us. So let's go ahead and store what we don't need. Let's sort this. We'll need all that. We don't need the cables. We don't need those right now. Don't need those. We'll hold on to those. The plastic we'll hold on to. We need more of those. We don't need those or those. We need the beams. Those we can get rid of. Those we can get rid of. Actually, no, we, I think we need some of those. But we need more plates. Um, and then more. The big deal item is going to be more of these guys, which I'm hoping... <laughs> Oh, I'm hoping that's enough to uh, actually complete the project, but I'm I'm honestly not sure. Oh gosh, well let's drive out. We'll take a look at what I've accomplished as well. It's taken a while, so <laughs> this episode I, I this episode I in the time it's taken me so far to record what I have so far this episode, I anticipated getting this part of this this satisfactory episode done, another satisfactory episode done, and uh, another episode of 911 operator done, but it just. It just didn't work out that way, so it is what it is. But yeah, there's my conveyor belt. Just circumnavigates the globe. But yeah, we'll drive up. So I've made this trip a few times today. Oh, Jiminy's. And we should, we actually probably will have enough, honestly, have enough plastic on or at the, at the refinery when we get there to complete our computer project. Um, but we'll see. But yeah, we probably, we probably will have enough. I can never get enough speed to get anywhere. I mean, just loses speed so rapidly going up this massive hill. And of course, it's getting dark right now as well. Oops, sorry, I got a little laggy there for a second. We're doing good. Come on, you can do it. All right, let's get this guy around here. So yeah, my conveyor belt goes across the water that way. I think I've taken, I mean, obviously it's not the shortest route because I could have obviously cut some, a little bit of corner. Oh, geez. I could have cut corners a little bit better. I always forgot I needed not go that far into that, but that's okay. We'll go over here and we should be able to build it right back up again. I'm not too worried about it. I've just been using the little, uh, is it, what is it? The oil cokes, oil cokes for uh, fuel. I did find a slug, just happenstance, just pure luck, found a slug, so I was pretty happy about that too. Just a green one, but I don't think you'll find a yellow one just by happenstance usually, or a purple one. I seem to be, I can't find purple ones even if I'm looking, because the purple ones give you four uh, power shard booster things, so those things are pretty legit. But yeah, the slugs are awesome, I love those things. Now that you, yeah, I used to question why I was grabbing them, but now that I know why I grab them, they're awesome. And even this area, which doesn't look super navigatable here, it's actually pretty easy to drive around the outside. It seems to be, I'll say that, and I'll probably get stuck in the water, but I didn't have any issues with it before. So hopefully I don't have issues with it now, but yeah, we'll drive out this way. Let's find, uh, I don't know how long this episode is gonna be either. This will probably be close to 20 minutes or so, I don't know. We'll see, but uh, I think the first segment was only like four or five minutes, but uh, I'm probably gonna wrap it up in this uh, recording. I'm hoping we can get this conveyor belt all the way in there a little bit better. What should I call this? We already kind of got oil production going on the last stream, so I don't necessarily want it. Oh, well, there we go. Uh, grab that. We're so close, but we have dangerous stuff that we, nope, not the truck. Look how big that thing is. That's legit, we need one of those. All right back at it let's just avoid the water now now we have plenty of room to drive on land about yeah mostly because i don't want to fight these guys i'll just drive by them so they ignore us but uh yeah i'm not sure what i'll call this episode and if it stays like this kind of coloration it's going to be hard to get a good screenshot could be the conveyor belt that goes clear across the world but it'll probably be something to do with the oil production or oil refining that'll probably be it honestly um just because we kind of talked about it a little bit in this episode but uh yeah, we'll see. Here's our oil, oil plants over here. And this is the closest oil to our base, but... Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, well, we made it. Where's my conveyor? There's where I made it with my conveyor belt. Do you see how close I was? Oh, ridiculously close. All right, let's see if we can't build that the rest of the way. These guys are going to get in my way, so let's just 
get them woken up a little bit. There we go. Knock these guys out of the... There we go. Those guys are dealt with now. Might as well grab these over here. All right. So. Let us finish. Is this shallow all the way? No, it's not. So let's get over there. Come on. And come on, get me up to land here. There we go. Oh, I don't have any concrete. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the biggest rookie mistake. Oh, I can't believe it. We came all the way out here without concrete. Ooh. Let me kill these guys off in my frustration. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Get out of here. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it. Where is the nearest limestone? I like just want to get... We don't need that much concrete. <sighs> Let's get our light on. Actually a pretty good light. I mean 9,000 years away. Oh, gosh. Oh. Uh, a thousand meters. <laughs> nope, I don't need that. Stop, stop scanning. We get... It's hopeless. All right. Well, that's... Uh, that's actually extremely depressing. <laughs> this is copper, isn't it, too? Is there no... There's got to be something somewhere. Oh. Oh no, guys, I can't believe I did that. How did I even do that? What is that one? I see a slug over there. That's at least worth checking out for that reason. Nope, that's copper. For sure not limestone. Is that a slug? No, it tricked me. It's just oil. Ooh, and bees, of course. And lots of other nasty things. Um... Anything. I'll take any form of it. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe the air of my ways. Oh, we don't want to drive into the water. Sure, copper's everywhere. We don't need copper. We need... Of course, I'll never find limestone when you're trying to find it. You'll only find it when it's in your way and it's just a waste of your time. Oh, gosh. Oh, is that limestone right there? That's like sulfur... There... There's no way we're that lucky. Oh, I think it is. Oh, gosh, yes. <laughs> we don't deserve it, but we did find it. How much is... Oh, it's not going to give us that much. Oh, maybe it is. It's giving me more than I thought already. Oh, quit. I've had enough of you. Leave me alone. Oh, gosh. All right, we'll drive this way. Oh, that guy's a really... That guy's a really big, mean guy. We got a lot of mean stuff around where we're setting up camp here. Okay. Oh, gosh. Craft bench. We have enough for 15. That should... I mean, that should do something, I think. Gosh, I can't believe it. I can't even believe I did I did that. I can't believe that. How much is a... I think it's like two? I don't know. It's, we'll just have to hope now. Gosh, I can't believe I did that, guys. I am so embarrassed. Not really embarrassed. I'm just maybe upset, frustrated, aggravated, angry cop. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. Oh my goodness. How could I possibly do that? How could I forget cement? That's like something I don't even 
even if I'm not gonna build anything, I always bring cement. Cause cement's just so useful. Oh gosh. Oh good, it only takes one to set one of those guys up. We should be good to go. We can't make this work. We're just gonna quit the game. I think we're done. We can't make this get over there it <laughs> within 15 posts. I think we're I think we're screwed. <laughs> I guess you get a little slug up there, right up over there. Yeah, right there. But anyhow. Oh goodness, I can't believe it. Hopefully you guys got a laugh and you're not like, oh you idiot. Did you guys were you guys watching and like, oh we forgot cement? Did any of you let me know down in the comments, did any of you look at that and go, oh we forgot cement, that dummy when I was packing up, or did you all forget to? And be honest. <laughs> oh, gosh. There it goes. It's all draining out now. Thankfully, faster it goes in. Oh, goodness. All right, well, I'm going to grab the plastic out of here. And then I'm going to connect this guy to that, and then that should pump it all away from here. There it goes, there it all goes. Plastic's going first too, which is great. Oh my goodness, well on that note, everyone, oh, if you enjoyed, drop a like down below. If you enjoyed my misery, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button up on the screen to join the Gamer Cop channel. And turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been GamerCop. Thank you guys for coming and watching.